So my name is Robin Christofferson and I'm Head of Digital Inclusion at AbilityNet and we're partnering the awards here this afternoon and I'm really pleased that everybody has turned up because it's such a vital area, technology, uh, speaking as a blind person myself. For me personally, technology has meant the difference between having a job and no job. I'm absolutely positive about that. Technology helped me get through my education, through university, and it enables me to work with a computer, with the internet, uh, write documents and reports, review websites, uh, code web, uh, web applications, mobile applications, that sort of thing. The whole world is open through technology for someone who's got no vision, like myself. I think the one thing that would really make a difference is if people considered accessibility or inclusive design in everything that they do. So my job title is Head of Digital Inclusion and it's about thinking about inclusive design. So every device had uh, the full range of people right across the spectrum, not just people who are able bodies but people who are elderly and have difficulties using their hands or seeing, right through to people like myself with a recognised disability. Um, if everything was built with the broadest range of uh, customer base in mind, then products would be much more accessible. And we're seeing that with the iPhone, for example. It's a mainstream product, it speaks out of the box, anyone can just triple click the home button on the iPhone and it will come up talking. It's got built-in magnification, it can drive a braille display if people want to read braille you can operate it just with a switch for someone who can only blink their eye for example there are lots of ways that you can extend the the way of using an iPhone because it's been built with inclusion in mind